I'd like to tell you about a disorder of humans that's a complex and fascinating sleep disorder called narcolepsy with cataplexy. In narcolepsy with cataplexy, you can think of the sleep state as invading the waking state. So people with this disorder tend to fall asleep very quickly and at inappropriate times. They have hallucinations when they're awake sometimes because they're dreaming when they're awake. It's a sleep appropriate response is appearing while they're awake. And they can lose their muscle control very suddenly so their bodies relax in the same way you relax when you're asleep. This happens sometimes with excitement. Now, very little was understood about the biology of human narcolepsy until certain dog owners noticed that their dogs had a disorder very much like human narcolepsy, that they fell asleep inappropriately and that they would collapse sometimes when they were excited. And Emmanuel Mignot, studying these dogs, was able to trace down the genetic changes that caused these dogs to have abnormal sleep-waking behavior. And what he found is that these dogs had a deficiency in a particular brain chemical called hypocretin that signals through a G protein coupled receptor called the hypocretin 2 receptor. Building out from this discovery and similar discoveries in mouse, we were able to make the discovery in humans that the exact same biological system is involved in human narcolepsy cataplexy as is involved in the dog disorder and in the mouse disorder. So there are neurons in the brain that make hypocretin. In human patients with narcolepsy and cataplexy, these neurons are typically lost through autoimmune destruction, leading to the loss of this peptide. The mouse mutants that I didn't tell you about that also have narcolepsy have a defect in the hypocretin gene itself. The dog mutant that I did tell you about these rare dogs that have narcolepsy have defects in the hypocretin 2 receptor. So what is this G protein coupled receptor and what is the signal it detects? The signal it detects is something called a neuropeptide, a peptide made by one neuron to communicate with other neurons.